Diesel and K&M Customs. Chico with Collision Custom Costumes. How did we get to this point right now? How did you two decide to collaborate? How did y'all, how did this merger happen? Throughout the years, Miles Pops used to be painting his cars back in the day. We just came, you know, we, we, we came together, just wanted to throw some cars together. We did a couple, and then one thing led to another, you know what I mean? Yeah. Unfortunately, we lost his Pops, you know what I mean? And uh, we wanted to keep him going, you know what I mean? Keep the legacy alive, so we just teamed up. He said, we, we lost your pops. For those who don't know, could you let us know who, who your pops is? My pops is V-Max with Ultimate Rider. It's dope that his legacy still live on through you and you putting together these cars. So how does that feel knowing that you kind of like inherited and the torch was passed to you? How does that feel? Feels good, man. You know, that's the reason we came out for his birthday and put the juice on the bumper just to show that everything is still Right now, we are in the presence of a one-stop shop. Am I, am I fair in saying that? One-stop shop. So that means I could bring you any anything and anything from engine work, paint, hydraulics, anything, all that could get done right here in this spot. Look. I stayed down till I came up. I kept it real with the people who never changed up. I made a deal with myself, don't change your lane up. They try to flex on me, I just step my game up. We get a rush when we shine, and could you blame us? I wasn't pitching, but listen, I got my change up. And now my Zenas be dancing to Macarena. They see the vision, I'm picture them trying to frame up. We got... We got some, look like some freshly painted beauties over here. Yeah, we get them together right now. We just started putting chrome on it. It's been outside for a little bit, but uh, yeah. we get them together to uh, 48 flea line, and you know, 39. So these were painted here. Yep. How long, how long was the process? Well, we're still waiting on the tear. The process on this one was probably like six months. Uh-huh. Um, for paint? Yeah, for paint. Uh -huh. Then we, you know, we gotta wait for the chrome to get out the chrome shop and stuff like that. Okay. And now we're waiting on the interior, so we got a little appointment going for the interior. It should be by by the end of July. We should be in the interior shop with it. Okay. Yeah. But but as far as like the process of like like in the well, booth, out the yeah, booth, in like in the booth, out the booth. Yeah, pretty much like six months. But this was a frame off too, so ah uh, the, the airbags. Uh, you know, these cars are rusted all on the bottom, so we did floor patches, all that stuff on it. Wow, wow. So complete frame off is pretty much that's what y'all yeah that's what y'all do i mean that's that's the best way to you know make sure it's good enough to get on the road nice nice and then what what we got over here what is uh it's a caprice glass house Ooh. that's almost out of here should be leaving this week this is beautiful man i love that green man Dude, that one freshly painted too of of all of these which one was like the one that kind of gave you the most hell as far as as far as paint? <laughs> I want to say a headache. It's just more of a frustration because, uh, you know, we wait on parts and then uh -huh. we got to go out there and hunt for parts for it. Right. Some of the stuff ain't available and then you got to fabricate some stuff to make it happen. You know what I mean? Okay. And then when it comes to the paint, you know, sometimes people don't know how to lay down silver paint. Uh huh. So sometimes you get uh, tagger stripes, what I call it, or uh -huh. blotchiness, you know what I mean? So that's it pretty much and from what i see man and from what my viewers gonna see because this is a uh, don't get it twisted this is 4k and y'all see ain't no y'all see ain't no blotches on this huh so somebody know what they doing yeah, exactly. <laughs> i got room to learn so if anyone knows something let me know i learn every day hey do your do your pops still come in and be like no no. Oh yeah, you know <laughs> we need to start a reality show around. <laughs> Y'all really watch us then. <laughs> hey, so yeah. pops, pops, sometimes come in and be like, "Nah, dog, this ain't how it's done. You yeah. need to do it like this, yeah. huh?" Yeah. You hey, know how it is. yeah, I know. Trust me, I get it. I get it. That's actually pretty dope, though, man. Like, yeah. and and it looks like, all right. So we we not only talking about cars. These jet skis, y'all did too. Yeah, these were yellow ones, but uh, we painted them. Are you serious? Yeah, all dirty right now. We've been outside for a little bit, but yeah, we did these too. Dang, so it ain't wow. Anything we can put paint on, we're gonna do it. <laughs> <laughs>
where do you have where do you find the room to or the i guess the canvas to experiment with different stuff like because i know you you know you probably don't want to just try stuff on customers cars like mm -hmm. like where do you well see that's why me and the customer build a relationship you know uh -huh. what i mean so if you tell me hey i want to do this color so what kind of color you want to go with? you want to go with a basic color uh -huh. you want to go with something wild right you know i mean we could right. do something wild we could go to candies uh -huh. we could do it with a simple base coat you know what i mean yeah but either way it goes we can we can make the dream come true you know what i mean just give me something to work with and i'll go from there solid we got some more stuff to tackle because uh not only we got paint we also got them low riders. We got them, uh, got that engine work, man. So, uh, let's step into your world, man. Hey, wake up in the morning, shine my C's up slowly, throw a nice tea on me while I'm listening to hoes. Hop up in the lactic politic with the homies. Paint a super black to let the sun glisten on me. I pull up to the park, couple marks trying to mug me. I ain't really gripping what I'm gripping, kind of. Man, so, you know, for the non gear heads, man, can you explain what we. What we looking at? Cause I know it. It looked beautiful, but explain at, explain to the to the common folk like myself what we looking at here. We're looking at a six liter GM motor, LS two, what a lot of people will call it, with a custom serpentine setup. Uh huh. And that's 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 in the front right here, right yeah, where. Right here, the serpentine belt. Yeah. So it don't naturally come with these pulleys. It comes with some, you know, gray ones. This color. Okay. But, uh, yeah. We got a custom pulley set up on there. Drop some headers on it. Goodness. Power. It's about 450 horsepower. Right Are you out. serious? Yeah. 450 horsepower right out the gate. And we coming with some funk in the trunk. <laughs> you already know. Yeah. All right. <laughs> we coming with some sticks. <laughs> hey. I'm not the type. I, I don't like to uh, ruin people's surprises, but it's up to you, man. You, you want to. You want to share with the people what, what we talking or, or you want to just kind of keep that under wraps and wait for somebody to pull up? Yeah, we could just leave that for, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all was telling me like just two weeks ago, the body was over here. The frame was over there and the engine wasn't wasn't in yet. And now all of this is together. Yeah, yeah. And E, my man E could vouch for that, huh? E, you can vouch for that. That's right. Hey, I was here. E was here. All right, so don't think we doing no no editing trickery, nothing. There's a couple of little people out there. They got little photos here and there. We uh huh. Select a few. Yes. Yeah. You know what I mean. So they know the real. I ain't yeah, gonna say we're the fastest, and I ain't gonna say we're the slowest, but it all depends on how. What do you want to do? Right. You know what I mean? Because there's different processes. You gotta remember this. This is full chrome on the carriage on here. Mm -hmm. You can do just the basic ink. Yeah. Powder yeah. coat everything black. The original frame, look, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Is the frame fully molded or is it partial? Know, or just stock? So, fully molded frames and wrapping the frames, y'all do that here too? Yeah, yep. Jeez Louise. Hey, like I said, man, it's really a super shop. And as far as as far as the the engine work is concerned, like are you are you putting like as much heat under there like to are, are you more of a go fast dude or is it kind of like just this because this is a pretty engine right, we can be on the freeway in the fast listen, lane bro, on we are go fast dude <laughs> <laughs> i'm telling you about, we, we gonna burn the tires off anything you know what i'm saying we'll, we'll even burn, even with the 13s you know, we might lose the date no <laughs> wait 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 wait, wait. This when, is the twentieth when the frame was shot. The twentieth of this what? The twentieth when he when he cleared the of car. Of June. The twentieth of June. This, Shut this up. Hey, what's, what's today's date? Twentieth of June. Now look. look Today it. is July second. This is July second. Now look, this this is on a body cart. If you notice in this video, look at the bottom. This is on a body cart. This is not on the frame. Oh. The frames, the, the battery rack ain't in. Nothing. No battery rack. Nothing. This is the 20th of June, 11 16, bro. Are you serious? Okay, this is the 20th of June, 10 36. He, he finished frame, painting the frame at night. The motor. June 21st, 1 14 a.m. This is what we're telling wow. you. Wow! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I just love doing this, you know what I mean? Like, I just do this for fun.
fun, but we just can't hang yeah, it up. We can't hang it up, man. man this is what we do, bro. This ain't everything we make. It's in my, of, it's in my veins. Yeah. Wow, I mean, girl. I, I bleed this. Hey, we just can't let it go. <laughs> hey, so, so where? Where if, if let's say somebody is watching this video and right now they like I need to call them right now, man. How can I get in touch? You can hit me, text me, call me, whatever, any time of day. Just uh, 909-994-1139. Uh huh. And then That's 424, Chico. 424-325-8285. That's Max. Yeah. So there it is, right there. I look, gave y'all the numbers. K and M right Customs, now. CCC. And wreck out there, come see your boy. Hey, hey, hey. I'll be riding all by myself. Sometimes I can't trust no one else. And I, I, I know some people don't understand me when my life gets so demanding. But I, I feel free when I'm in my zone. I feel free when I'm riding alone. So I ride. I was riding down the Hella late, low out of therapy when my car starts to levitate. It's cold outside, but I don't mind, so my window low. Moon roof open, it got me scoping how the planets glow. Maybe I'm tripping, but I feel God show me favoritism. Blessings keep coming, and every time I hear him talk, I listen. Look how I glisten when I be floating in that Cadillac. Seconds be ticking and turn to minutes, you can't have them back. So give me my time, give me my space, and some Marvin Gaye. Passing my exit just for.